and welcome thine selves back to the sixth stream. Uh, getting ready for a farmer, and we just got a new duplicate. And I was looking at it, but we got a new printable. But spoilers, I want to pick a duplicate Turner because he has farming. Now, is it the best farming ever? No. Do we want a farmer anyways? Yes. Does he just hate animals completely? Absolutely. But uh, we won't send him to that half of the map. We'll just have him uh, stay over with the animal or the, away from the animals with the plants. Uh, he will need a new bed, which is under furniture. Yes. Well, we got plenty of tables. Um, so food is a little bit scarce and just like we were just about to hit 20 thousand calories which made me so happy and we've we have since tanked but we just got more meat right there these things are so tanky and they don't give any more meat than a regular hatch uh which one of my hatches got elderly and died but there was a replacement hatch right here that i dug up so just swapped him out um we actually have eggs going into the evolution chamber so I think after this last hatch egg, I'll set these all to stone hatches. And any regular hatch egg that we get is just going to get dumped in there. And come what of it will what happen of it. That's just, that's so weird. Both of them wailing on it and it's just sitting there sleeping. Like, yeah, no big deal. Except I'm going to be meat here in a little bit. Blech. That's sad. But such is the circle of life. Uh, I did also tweak with the timers on these just a little bit. Gave them 2% extra duration. Just to try and make sure that all of them get lullabied. That one's a new one, so that's uh, that one has an excuse. But these two, I watched them just not get lullabied. And that is unacceptable in the race for meat. Uh, Turner, you are going to join Catalan? Cattle line on that schedule. Uh, and you are going to have a very specific job. I suppose I should get him a skill, which will be farming. You're going to do it and you're going to love it. As soon as this thing gets built, we will actually have a greenhouse. If it's so weird to be building it 62 cycles or yeah cycles in and uh, I was looking through things just to see what all I might need to watch out for and I did see this produce 10 tons of refined metal by ranching smooth hatches so I didn't think we needed smooth hatches we do need smooth hatches kind of weird that one didn't like come up when I was searching for critters. Oh, I didn't know those were actual achievements. We'll worry about those later. But carnivore. We're uh, about halfway through it. So we're picking up speed pretty quick here. So I have hope. It might be false hope, but I have hope. And it is built. We have a greenhouse with room for expansion. This is one of the strange rooms that I want to build low because then you can build it long and get more out of just one building. Uh, yeah. Oh, we don't have crop tending. Boo. Boo, Turner. I thought that you would be better than you are right out of the gate. Yeah, let's see. Crop tending is the second tier in, so he gonna have to just be a normie for a little while. But I do want to get a Sweetle and drop a Sweetle off in there because they make farming a little bit better. So we're gonna grab just a ladder. 
Uh, priority six, because I do kind of want it done sometime. We'll dig back down to these guys. And I, I that was something I did before the restart, as you may recall. But I just didn't find enough reason to spend the effort this time on the second go around. But I still do need a Sweetle, both for just general achievement. I need to tame one at some point. And I want them to make my meal wood better. We'll just drop a bunch of them off there. So this little guy that just hatched, I don't think we're actually going to uh, eat him, I think. Because we have an elderly hatch right here. I think we're going to wrangle him. Uh, and drop him off up there. Pretty sure they can still eat sandstone, but we're like out of sedimentary rock. Can a smooth stone hatch eat? Nope. None of that. Okay, so what I'm going to actually do is deconstruct that because it hasn't been used in a while. We'll build a second feeder. And we're just going to start turning these guys into stone hatches. Just because stone hatches are easier to feed than regular hatches. And uh, we're just getting more eggs of the stone hatch variety. How far along are you? 50%. Hey, okay, so this guy I guess we will eat. And that guy we can put in there. Potato, potato. I don't really care who goes where. So simply because it's taking rad bolts so long to generate, I think I'm just going to start queuing up some of the other basic research. I say basic, but I mean ones that still have uh, advanced. Just so that I have them available if and when I need them. And we don't have to worry about them later. Like this one, liquid tuning. Aqua tuning, or... Yeah. Thermo aqua tuners, often just called aqua tuners, are very worthwhile. So we can wait for this thing to generate a bunch of rad bolts since it takes them five ever to do that. And, uh... Get something useful while we wait. Mealwood seeds growing along nicely. Calories got high and then low again. The swings are wild. We about to get some more barbecue though. Okay, so we're getting our first batch of our homegrown meal lice in. So I'm gonna go and start just ripping up a few of these that have been causing me more grief because of their strange placement. I don't feel like I need them anymore. I think we're gonna be just fine with what we got. And uh, I'm going to, I think, put in a proper bathroom right here with a strange dirted roof. But they've been using this for such a long time. <coughs> Excuse me. And we're finally, like, stable. Well, I don't even have it. Well, I'll have to research that first. We're about to get the second bit of liquid. Then I'll do sanitation. It's been that. We've been like 65 cycles without a shower. Wow. Um, but yeah. Just kind of get, yeah, get that going, I guess. Just not that bit. And door there. Yeah. I mean, we're, we're kind of getting stable. I'm having to put a lot of eyeballs on them to make sure that they do things in the right order. Like, it kind of irks me a bit. But both of these ranchers would rather stay here and groom their hatches all day long than go lullaby eggs. Even though the priority of grooming is five... That one was eight, that one was five. Didn't make a difference. 
and all of these things are nine. It's like the nine is only for supply, and then they don't care about lullabies. So even though I gave them a little bit extra time, I still like watch this at the start of every cycle and uh, just kind of like grab one and manually throw them in there to get the ball rolling. And then after the first 12% of the day, they've groomed all their hatches for the most part and they can be dedicated to lullabying the eggs. But we are doing good work. Carnivore, it hasn't been that long since I checked it, but we've crossed the 2,000. We're halfway there with 37 more days to go. It, I don't know, barbecue. Basically, I want to see that number be zero at the end of the day. I might have to just get more dupes. Meal ice is supposed to be a fallback for when we don't have barbecue. But, uh, I think it's possible. There's all that. Yep. Just gonna hit all the little exclamation points to have it go away. Find me a toilet. I think it's possible, because we definitely ramped up over the last few days. At 48 days, we were at 120 calories. And in 20-ish days, less than 20 days, we've eaten over 80,000 calories. And that's largely because the supply has finally caught up with demand, as it were. So, I don't know. I'm going to feel real bad if 100 rolls around and we haven't gotten enough. I might just have to, like, in the last week, eat all my hatches. There's... There's the farmer that I needed. Why not? I want an extra duplicate to just help around with things. And, uh... We can have... Turner here? Just be more of a janitor. Which are, well, you know, one of them's gonna get crop tending before the other. But who did we just get? Lyra. No duplicate names yet. I think they've probably programmed that in the game. But farming one for you, and we'll slap a farming hat on you. And Turner. I guess you can keep your farming hat for now, but as soon as I see a skill point on you, you might get it anyways, just so that we can apply the uh, fertilizer to this, but... See that barbecue number? Gone! And now we know how to make a toilet. Uh, mesh tile. Lavatory. Shower and sink. So we're gonna put down, we'll do three sinks. Oh, I didn't put a tile there yet. How silly of me. And I mean, three toilets. We'll do an upgrade size wise. Um, I was playing with these timers again and have it start at the day so if one of these eggs needs a lullaby hopefully the nine overrides the five of where they're at so I just gotta uh, kind of mess with them a little bit well I probably shouldn't mess with them too much until they've all been lullabied Otherwise, you know, they just won't get it for a day. I also moved the hatch drop-off right here, just so that they aren't running back and forth all the time while we're trying to kill them. That's making things a little bit tricky. 
But yeah, give those eggs a good hug. And we'll back that back down to twelve. Yeah. So start a day. End a day. Five. Yeah. I know there's a good there's there's math where the duration of a hundred percent equals the fraction you need, but I don't know that formula off the top of my head. So I just kind of eyeball it. Like right there, we say that's right right above the little crook right there. So we'll just that one's already almost there. Back it up just a little bit, and good. That one's going to run out in 30 seconds. I don't know if that's going to stay on for 30 seconds. Ooh, 11. No, it's not going to. So that's one of the downsides. If these guys get caught on the tail end of something, there, this will not stay active long enough to incubate them again. Which is why, if I could do my memory toggle setup that I wanted to do, it would work a lot better. But, that's that's not happening. Nope, sirees. I suppose I could set up redundant timers. Like, do a whole second set. That then does this all again at the end of the day. Because, let's see, this, one, this one's done, like, halfway through the day. So if we set up another timer right here that tripped on these two that started right there to go back around and catch what we missed, that'd be even more efficient. I don't know if I'm going to worry about that too much just yet. Barbecue on the low side, that's nice. Lice loaf is pretty big, that's fine. We can have big lice loaf as long as, wrong button, carnivore is still getting munched down. 16. Yes. I like it. So for now, I'm just going to plumb the bathroom into the sieve that's already here and just deconstruct. I meant to get the vent. I got the pipe that was behind it. Same effect. Uh, water will now go through here. Not the prettiest layout, but it'll work for what I have now make it prettier later again i'm i'm playing this weird mind game where i'm leaving as many natural tiles as possible in the map so that i can maybe make them into reserves if i need to later i don't know it's kind of a weird thing but it, it stops me from running pipes in other places but uh, I just, since this pump's already here, we're going to do regular water as soon as someone goes and gets it. Just any, any water. Any water will be fine. This is getting a little low, actually. Might need to finally start tapping into some of the other water around the map. I think I could, uh somehow just put a pitcher pump right there suck up some of that I don't know I mean there's lots of polluted water that I could start sieving and branch water that I could start purifying and this thing that's still doing this stuff what I don't like is just figuring out how to get it from where it's at to where I want it in a nice convenient manner. So we'll worry about that when this doesn't have any more water. I mean, at the very least, I could probably start building tiles here and forcing some of this water back up. And that would extend my uh, stay for quite a while. We might just start working towards some of that. Probably need 
One, two, three, four. Just, just too high. Put one ladder there. And the tile. Actually, I don't need to do that. We can build sideways through that. So we can build a tile right there. Yeah, why not? And we'll build a tile right there. Did you guys drop any water off yet? Empty. So no. The answer is no. I have auto bottling on. Oh, it's sweep only. Herkader. Now we should see some of that move in pretty quick. Um, ooh, we got a fair bit of rad bolts stored now. So before we start zapping the ground, we should probably start researching that again. Like this guy right here. You're going to fire off five, and I'm pretty sure that won't go through. I don't know why where we lost two. But we're actually going to put that to one. We're going to move you off that just for a little while. I appreciate... Dang, Devin. I see a lot of these dupes kind of hurt. I don't know what's happening. Like, it, is it slime lung exposure or what? But I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know where he getting that. Might just have to build a triage cot. Might do that right there. Since I have the space for it. We'll just... Do something like that for right now. And I think they actually take power now. No, maybe not. It's a massage table. We'll throw down one of those and uh, just see what comes of it. And I'm going to have to watch and make sure they don't entomb themselves like the idiots that they are. Let's see, do we got... We got water in the pipe? Yeah. Okay. You can be done now. We don't need a full pipe. Because that'll actually cause problems when uh, they make too much polluted water. We the, These bathrooms are water positive. You always get a little bit more water out of them than you put in them. So you gotta watch out for that. But yeah, that's that's good to go. Hey, you didn't trap yourself. That's nice. So, Devin, get in there and, and, f and get rid of those moderate wounds that are making you gimp about a little bit. Look at all that food. Oh, so much food. Still in lice loaf, but still. It's nice to not be on the verge of death all the time because of that anymore. But anywho, I think I've made some good progress with this episode. I'm just going to let it run for a little while. Um, I don't think you need to be there anymore. Outside of a hospital. <laughs> Get out. Go do your work. But yeah, I think I accomplished what I wanted to do. Uh... So I'm just going to let it run for a little while longer. I can't think of anything big that I want to do. I'll just have to wait some of it out and see what happens. Like the meat stuff. I just iced two more heads. Oh, we don't have electricity. We ran out of electricity. There's meat on the wheel. Oh, we didn't build... <coughs> Excuse me. We didn't build meat. A cot. Ah, panic. Click. A bed. He had to sleep on the ground. But. Let's see. Our barbecue is gone. Just absolutely gone. All of our calories are in lice loaf right now. Uh, which says that we are doing exactly what I want for carnivore which we got another 8,000 calories just there so 
I'm about to get some more. But anywho, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. We're making some progress. Fingers crossed that things will go the way that we need them to go. And I will see you in the next episode. Oh, trolling.